Hello and welcome back, folks. I'm Manic Mink. This is Europe Universalis 4, and, uh, kind of have what I think is some bad news. Um, it looks like this save game is definitely not Iron Man mode anymore. I don't know why. It's still cloud synced. It was Iron Man mode starting out this entire time. Uh, it just decided with the latest patch to, I guess, not make it Iron Man mode anymore, which means. Unfortunately, our achievement for uh, getting the entirety of the Baltic Sea is not going to happen. Kind of disappointing. Um, I'm going to keep playing until I get that, because in my mind, that's the achievement. But uh, kind of a bit, kind of a bit upset about that. To be honest with you, I don't wasn't expecting it, and uh, it it sucks. I I don't know why I'm kind of I kind of wanna shake down someone for answers. Uh, yeah, huh? All this work, huh? Nothing, nothing coming of it, unfortunately. It seems. Um, I don't I don't know why Crimea, Uzbek. Uh, you. Overt action. Let's uh, let's pull someone from here. Stop improving relations because we're gonna go to war with you again. Uh, I think. Yep. You are. Yeah. Because uh, Muscovy is currently at war with Crimea, Uzbek, Timurids, Persia, and the Mamluks, which is basically everyone here. Uh, I'm going to go to war with one of their one of their friends. Um. Hopefully Austria doesn't get dragged into this. They did get dragged into that, so they'll be unlikely to join another war currently. Uh, or should I go for Mecklenburg? Bohemia, Brandenburg, Oldenburg, Saxony. You are at war with Crimea. Are you moving your troops, though? That's my question. I don't believe you're moving your troops. Hmm. So that's the thing. If they were moving their troops, I'd go, oh, good. We're going to totally, uh, totally be able to go to war with them. Uh, or not necessarily with them, but, you know. Totally be able to go to war in the Empire. But... Ooh, that's good. It looks like, uh, yeah. Palatinate will become the Emperor next time if nothing changes. Which, again, I hope nothing changes. Uh, let's get... Better troops. Gallop cavalry. Yes. Uh, and leather cannon is better than that. Correct? Yes. Uh, military access from the Timurids. Sure, we'll give you that much. Uh, let's fleet maintenance up and army maintenance up. And we will, once we get a little bit more gold, build another workshop, too. There. Let's go you, you, you. Uh, military leader. We need 50 points for a military leader. We only get five, because this guy has terrible... You know what? I have a... T my air is better. Monarch to the rescue in terms of gen- Holy crap! You have one military power and like, five shock? What even is? Jesus, that's crazy. Um... Yeah, that's absolutely nuts how much military power that guy has. Um, right. Let's go. Diplomacy. We can't fabricate a claim, because we already have all of the claims claimed. Right? That makes sense. Yes? Uh, you are at war. Yes. Good, good, good. Uh, and their troops are even leaving. Oh, this is... And you're not the Emperor anymore. Oh, man. So, first things first, we're going to... Uh... Right, we're going to go to war here, declare war, take Kurland, call all willing allies, Holstein won't join, Great Britain won't join, everyone else will. 
Good. There, there, there. You, I will put this leader on. Uh, boats, boats, where are you, boats? Fleet is over here, so I will... Uh, come over this way. As Muscovy, Livonian Order, Bavaria, and the Papal State are at war with me. Um, you know, a bit unfortunate, but not the end of the world. So we now have... Yes, battle there, that's fine. Um, I'd love to have your fleet sit here, please, Teutonic Order. Uh, and also, if you noticed, uh... Oh, excuse me, the Palatinate is now the Holy Roman Emperor. Which means we can go to war for Mecklenburg and not really run into problems because Palatinate is... These three provinces, and you're allied with... Oh, Lithuania, France, Austria, Augsburg, and Venice. Jesus. <sighs> hmm. How to... how to maneuver that. Um, you are Catalonian nationalists... Uh, can't improve relations with Austria, Poland, Brandenburg, Bohemia. Oh, we're at war with Austria. I'm surprised. I would have thought Austria would have stayed with their Crimean situation going on uh, and not decided to come up here and fight me. Let's go Austria. Sue for peace. Uh, no, that's too... way too much. I don't really need the peace that badly, to be honest with you. Uh, let's... Detach a blockade. You go up here. And blockade that. We can hopefully get almost all the Livonian order before they actually... get around to getting close to me. Uh, a bit unfortunate. Ustiug. That's also unfortunate. I would have thought for sure you guys would have been too involved to, uh... to get over to me. On the plus side, that does mean that they're not going to be involved in the war against Mecklenburg. Uh, I think... Right? That should make sense. Uh, okay, siege through all this stuff. How are they already? Oh, they have 11 cannons. That's how. Jeez, crazy. No, we... There we go. Now we break them. Good. Uh, follow them. They will go somewhere else. I'll follow you down to Trakai, I guess. See if I can catch you there. Good. Feed their entire army. Now we can come back up here. Um, right. This is mostly just Austria is sieging Bohemia. Which I didn't really want. Siege of Kurland is finished. That's good. Uh, move our siege to here. Jovostiug has finished in their favor, unfortunately. This can come over here. Why are these not popped up and paused? Okay, siege through this. 
Bohemia and all all treaties, that's fine. Hungary, of course, is being eaten as well. We lose all of our allies over there because Austria is nearby. Uh, if Austria has a peace treaty with me, or a uh, truce with me, they might not be able to... Uh... Good, this is good. Go down here. Uh, we hit the max of our improved relations. Improved relations with you. Catalonia. That's new. 45,000 troops. That, uh, that Austrian... Let me actually see this. Uh, armies. Austria. 95,000 of 61,000. Possible. So that's, that's the good thing, is that they have way over their troop limit, and they will hopefully disband those at some point. Maybe. Um, problem, though, is that we're still really losing this war. Um, mostly because of Austria. Uh, were it not for Austria, they would probably be losing quite badly. Uh, okay, so I can siege through the rest of this pretty quickly, and then go and fight Muscovy. Good. You go here. Uh, we'll actually send you to Trakai. Let's see, um, uh, Muscovy, what would it take to get 150 for that? So let's go Kurland Dorpot. Maybe. That would be nice. Uh, 63 there. Come on, you should... You should be able to do this soon, right? Workshop, 57, 54, 54... Uh, is there anything else of significantly higher value that I could do? 48, 48, 48, 48, uh, 40. Sure, we'll do that. Okay, come over here now. Siege through essentially a hundred percent of this. Um, Austria still at war with me. You still at war with Scandinavia, Crimea. Hopefully they will be doing a bit better. Uh, let's go up here to Cargol, and maybe they will not be able to. Lewenden. Nope. We should actually stick around here just to make sure. Uh, when Austria attacks. Yep, Austria has attacked. Good. Yes, I know that. Let's have everybody head over here. Uh, you guys can come up here, actually. Nope, I did not want to have you run away to there, but alright, thank you. Um... Actually, you guys come here, and then we'll all come and hit them at one time to try and destroy that army. Lithuania, will you give me access? Um, good, you are marching to Vilna. We'll be there on the 17th. If I march you to here, that is the 22nd. Now I hit you. Um, would have much preferred to have my leader in charge of this battle, but... I guess Teutonic Order got their leader instead, because we need to lose this battle, obviously. How are we still frickin'... Jeez, come on. Fine. Uh, let's clear off her. Austria. Can we get Austria out of this war? If 
Pomerania as a sovereign state. Where is Pomerania? We'll pay 141 ducats. Okay, that's fine. Um, you are... Our overlord abandoned us. No, we, we were forced to, you idiots. Um, let's improve relations here. Good. Uh, and you have CB. You would not accept vassalization. Uh, you are still there. Okay, so this is fine. Poland out of there. You can go up here to recover your manpower a bit. Uh, and we'll siege through the rest of this. This will be good. Um, <laughs> Brandenburg will accept an alliance with me. How many troops do they have? That's enough. Um, this. You are at war with Hess, Spain. What is Spain at war with? Spain, you are at war with Saxony, uh, and a bunch of others. Bohemia, Brandenburg, Oldenburg, Saxony, and the Hansa. What I need to do is I need to get into Mecklenburg, like, now-ish. Because that's going to be the only way that I can actually, uh, not get this achievement, I suppose. But that's the arbitrary ending that I set for this series, so that is when I want to end the series. And I do want to end this series at some point. It's just, you know, it's getting a bit long in the tooth, I guess, and, uh... You know, I don't want to go on forever. I'll put it like that. 7th of May, 31st of May, you guys go down here and crush them. Again, really would have preferred my commander in this, but uh, apparently Riga has their leader. Instead, because like I said before, what we need to do is lose a war. Oh, now I'm... Nope, nope, now that's just... Uh, the ridiculously powerful Russian leaders. How the hell do they keep doing that? Uh... Frick, man. 16 military tech. We have higher military tech than them, we just can't frickin' beat them. So you will lose and run away, of course, because we have a terrible leader. Good. Thank you, um, Riga. I really appreciated your assistance in this battle. Uh, in that I could have won it without you, but instead you decided to just fuck me. <sighs> More than a bit frustrated. Boost war exhaustion, boost ability, sure, that's fine. Can I put the leader on... No, it's the leader's here. That's why he's not in the fight. Damn it. Uh, let's detach enough troops to do a siege. Go over here. No leader. Come back. You, leader. Good. Uh, of course, they're just marching their troops slowly through here, and you have probably finished your... Nope. You're, uh, you're still fighting Crimea, which is kind of impressive, given that uh, I thought you would have given up by now. Rebel 
Rebels in Kurland, of course there are. Brandenburg, Holstinian Conquest. Um, no, I don't want to do that. Okay, so we're going to have to come back to this next time. I really am getting frustrated with this game. Like, incredibly frustrated right now. This is not... You cannot fight Muscovy. They are just gigantic. And uh, I don't know what else to do. So, yeah. We're going to come back next time. I'm Manic Mink. This is European Universalis 4. Talk to you later. Take care.